everyone, Shea Bear 1000 here. Today, I'm in Tampa, Florida, waiting on Monkey to get out of the doctor. She had to go in at 2, so we got here a little early. So she hasn't probably, probably hasn't even called, been called back yet, but that's okay. Me and Bruno are sitting here waiting on her. I got old Blue out. Um, I got the Axe 53 in the back. So this one I just kept up here on the seat by me so in case something weird happened I could turn the camera on real quick it's going to storm now I've been looking up online there's supposed to be a white castle here in Tampa I don't know because when I looked at the map it's supposed to be in a mall but none of the restaurants there are saying white castle I thought there was only one, and that's in Orlando. Now, there is a number. I may call them, but we'll see. So, hopefully, we'll get to do that. I don't know where I'm going to put the drone up because we are really close to the Tampa International Airport. I think that's where I flew in out of when I flew down here six years ago this month. Yeah, this. No, September. Next month. Yeah, September. So, here we got some boomers coming. It rained a little bit, a couple places on the way down. It rained here for a couple minutes. But we got a storm rolling in, so it's kind of vlogging for you. So I don't know if I'll be able to get the drone up anywhere around here, but we'll see. So hopefully, I'll call that number and we'll see if if uh, if that's real or just fake. I don't, I don't know. I thought there was only one, but she told me this morning, she said, Hey babe, there's a White Castle in Tampa. So it's saying it's there, but there's no comments on it, no reviews, and really no website. It's just a phone number and hours. It says they're closed on Sunday. They're open Monday through Saturday till 5 p.m., but they're closed Sunday. I don't know, guys. Um, we'll have to see, so. Uh, I'm gonna give him a call and find out and then I'll be back with you in a minute. <laughs> what is that all about? Okay, this sucks. We got a green light just as the crossing bars came down. Yeah. Man. It's coming, I hear it. Train's coming, Bruno. Okay guys, so uh, we stopped at Wingstop, got some wings. We were just eating them in the car here, going down the road. I wanted to get the hell out of Tampa. And uh, I was going to show you that train. I still had the screen open on the camera and everything. All I had to do was hit record. But I was like, where's the rest of it? That thing was shorter than this. Then a little tiny train with a great big horn. I, by the time I got the camera up, it was gone. I was like, where the hell's the rest of it? It's a tiny thing. But I won't be able to get the drone up because, well, Yeah, so I'll kick you back on when we see something else going on, right, Mom? Yeah. All right. We'll be back. Oh, I said, what's going on there? I don't know. Looks like it broke down. Broke down. Mm -hmm. Fell off and broke down. 
There's the courthouse in Burksville, and one of those trees there is the hanging tree. Like the monkey said, the hanging tree. Yeah. So we're not far from the house now. We're oh, 30 minutes, 23 miles, or something like that. Okay, you don't go straight. Oh man, you're right. Why do you always argue with me? I know I'm right. Yeah. Oh, shit. I gotta make a fight. Cause this is where we were coming out of, yeah. and we got pulled over right down here. What are you stressed out for? Cause stupid shit. <laughs> What'd you do? I went the wrong way, I guess. You was going up. The wrong way road. I guess. I didn't know that. Did it say that? No. Just said left or right. Didn't say it was going wrong way or anything. So I had to go turn around. Guess I went the wrong way. <laughs> God almighty. Pretty cool, huh? Not really. For one way. I don't want to do that I, again. That cop didn't think it was funny when I said we're only going one way. <laughs> no, he didn't think we were funny at all. No, see there's a red arrow. I don't like Brooksville. Anyway, right down in there, straight ahead there, kind of like right that way, that's where the uh, abandoned subdivision is. They're doing work in there. Are they really? Yeah. Do you want to have a drive down there? No, we can. Well, yeah. We'll drive down in there and see what they're doing. Yeah. Well, I wonder what they're doing. That would be interesting. There, though. No. I have to go up and 400 feet, turn left onto Cleveland Avenue. Take the next left onto Cleveland Avenue, then turn left onto South Saxon Avenue. That place Avenue. is supposed to be haunted. Yeah. Yeah. Take the next left onto South Saxon Avenue, then I turn like right onto North there. Broad Street. There is a wedding venue down here we looked at. Yeah, we did. Sure did. Bruno, get in the back. Get in the back, oh, Bruno. We can't go there. They're blocked. Yeah. Oh, no. And that's it, right? No. No. Go straight. No, that's them. That's what that is. Okay. Yeah, we were gonna stop here once, remember, and they were closed. Who was closed? That that make a U turn, place. then turn right onto South Saxon Avenue. Just turned you down. Yeah, I'm turn around you. It's a wedding venue. It's a big barn. Yeah, that's really crazy. We walked too. back in there. They gave us a tour because they was already given a tour, so they let us walk along. Yeah. There it is. Yeah. Real pretty in there. Walk, they walked us all the way down around through there. Yeah, yeah look. look oh, wow. Doing. Look what they're doing. They put fences up. Oh, my God. Well, it's kind of good, you know. It is very good. So, they open these all up again? I don't know, and I think they're working on them. Because that's all private property. Yeah, that back there is. Yeah. Which they're working on that too, apparently. Yeah. Private property, no trespassing or soliciting.
Well, we'll just have to go around. I'll make a right and go up and around. Lots of traffic here. Yeah, look, this is. I'll throw some clips. Oh, wow. They've really changed it. They're all being lived in now. Wow, it's nice to see that, though. Yeah. It really but, is. Yeah, it really is. But I'm saying it wasn't that long ago we were down here. Yeah. Uh -uh. And all these places were abandoned. Well, they weren't abandoned, but you could go in them. Some of them was unlocked. Yeah. Mm. We went in a couple up through here. Yeah. This is what it looks like now. Wow. And put trees out and everything. It's cute. All different colors. Very nice. Yeah, we went in a couple houses up here. Yeah, we did. There were nice little apartments. There, well, they're houses. I wonder how long it's been open. I don't know. Last I knew, they were working on. I told you that. Yeah. I said we need to go down and fly the drone over. Well, it's good to know. Every one of them's filled up now. Yep. Sure is. Because <laughs> we parked right straight ahead there. Yep. And we yep. walked around through here. The first time we drove. Yeah. The second time we had those boys with us. Yeah. We parked right there, both of us. Yeah. Right there now parking lot straight ahead there. Yeah, there's okay. none of them's empty now. No. Nope. Very nice. I'm glad. Yeah, I'm glad somebody did something with it. Yeah, me too. Because it was empty a long time. Yeah, look at that place now. Yeah. Over in there. Well, he's done a lot of work over there. Wow. Put new roofs on and stuff. Fence here now. Yeah. <coughs> Very cool. And you went back there. Mm-hmm. That guy yelled at us. Yeah. That guy was mine. I said, fuck you. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. He started his tractor back off. He kept on mowing. I was like, fuck you, man. Yeah. Well, it was private property. Well, it's the way he said it. Yeah. He said, hey. I said, what? 
get the hell out of there. That's fucking private property. I said, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> fucking private property. You know, if he just said, hey, you know, sorry, but you can't be back in here, no problem. Oh, yeah, I got to go. Right? I need to pave the street. Here or up there? Here. Yeah, well, that's good to know that they're using it. I like that this is still brick, but down through there, down over the hill, they need to pave that right. Yeah, they do. All right, guys. Wow. That's an update on the, uh, what was it called? <laughs> but so yeah, that's an update on that place. So, <laughs> they were but, something, wasn't it? What? It was called Brooksville Apartments. No, it was nothing like that. They were they were hide apartments. That's what they were. But okay, there's that. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, we're back home now. I'm still using old blue because. Well, I used old blue all day because I can just, like I said, I put the Axe 53 in the back and I can't be twisting around trying to grab that thing because I had it on a tripod. So I just grabbed this one for real quick shots and ended up using it all day. So why break precedence, right? So Hillside Estates, that's pretty cool. Uh, stay tuned for a before and after video that uh, should be the next video after this one. Um, pretty wild how things change. I know it was sold in 2019, so I don't know if that's the buyer that did all this work or not. So, but I know not long after that they did start working on it, and so yeah, uh, pretty cool. So anyway, guys, kind of like my vlog for today, and uh, hope y'all had a great day, and. We'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Shea Bear, the Myth of Man of Legend. I'm gone for now. Bye-bye, guys. Take care. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later.